darkness makes a fine weapon with which to crush the Justice League. And you will be my next victim. No, no! Tell me your name, boy. I want to know who I have killed. The Tara, the magician. Help! Batman, help! On my way, Zatara. Von Bach, back off. Wonder Woman, you will be next. But this, I will crush the magic out of this. No, you won't. I'm stuck! Diana, you stabbed him through the chest. He left me no choice. One of the others, one of your people, would have died otherwise. Diana! They began this. I will finish it. Did you see that? She killed him! She killed Von Bach! Get her! Get her! Get out! Be quiet, child. We don't kill. We'll finish this without you, Bruce. Your people are out of their league. Why? Because we're here to save lives rather than take them? We're here to force peace. We're left with no choice. If you stand in the way, I will remove you. Force peace. The Amazon tenant. Spread love and understanding, but don't be afraid to bloody your knuckles doing it. Don't tell me you still subscribe to that paradox. I do what a warrior must. I've heard rumors that the Amazons relieved you of your duties and heritage for not being strident enough. Face the truth, Diana. You won't win back your royal station by overcompensating. You aristocratic bastard! How dare you condemn me! The princess accuses me of being patrician. I'm cut to the quick. I will not be judged by you. After all these years, you have the nerve to swagger out of your cave and expect everyone to bow before your precious wisdom. Well, it's too late for that, Bruce. Bruce! Bruce! Dad! Nightstar, have you seen Bruce? He just took off into the sky with Wonder Woman. It, it, it looked like they were fighting. Damn, I wanted to talk to him. Dad, or should I call you Robin when you're in costume? This is no time for jokes, Nightstar, considering we're on opposing teams here. I'm not against you, Dad. You didn't join me either, and there's no time to argue now. That's why I have to say this now, before things get any worse. Dad, I think we've chosen different methods, but we both want peace. Isn't that touching? Six, six, six. Yeah, Birdman. I wanted another shot at that wonder hag, but you'll do. Ah! Dad! Looks like your old man's gotten his wings clipped. That's what he gets for holding back and playing by old-fashioned rules. He might six, but I don't. Ah! Nightstar! Dad, Dad, are you... Uh, head wound. Probably. Concussion. Should have seen it coming. Must be getting old. No, but you're definitely getting out of here. Now! You can't block these sword thrusts forever, Bruce. The sky is more my element than yours. You don't want to kill me, Diana. <clears throat> Look at the chaos you've caused already. We tried to hold order, damn you. But it's too far gone. Our only answer now is... By the gods. What is that? Open your eyes, Diana. You questioned how best to end this battle. Your answer flies on metal wings. Those are Blackhawks, nuclear carriers, the ultimate war bringers. Our war is not one act of violence at the cost of some lives. Our war ends in extinction. If you're that devoted to the Amazon honor, if your soul genuinely longs for atonement on Amazonian terms, then let's keep fighting and let the planes do their work. I... we... Let's go. I alone, among all humanity, witness the heroism that follows as Batman and Wonder Woman race toward the three approaching jets. Despite my spectral form, I feel the heat of Batman's lasers as they melt one nuclear bomb to its frame. I feel the strain of titanium muscles as Wonder Woman cripples the second. I see them both watch in horror as the final aircraft hurtles beyond their reach. I hear the bomb bay doors open. I hear the whisper of a pilot begging forgiveness over the sound of distant thunder. 
can't take much more. Shazam! Uh, enough! I guess what Superman will do a moment before it happens. <laughs> Shazam! Enough! Faster than the eye can follow, Superman's hand lashes out, clutching at Captain Marvel, holding him in place as the lightning strikes. And when the dust settles, the Man of Steel holds Billy Batson in his grip, one hand clamped over the young man's mouth. For one frozen instant, the storm clears. Fingers that can fuse coal into diamond crawl across human bone. And in the hush, ears that can hear a cell divide pick out with chilling ease the scream of human rage. A wave of x-rays confirms the bomb's potency. A telescopic glance calculates the seconds before impact. He must act now. Norman McKay. It is time. Spectre, what? Judgment has come, Norman McKay. The hour tolls. Our entire journey has brought us to this moment. But the bomb, the bomb! Will determine the fate of the world if it drops. The superhumans will surely die, but humanity will be spared their violence. If not, they will live on to fight a battle that will, in time, Swallow the earth. Maybe heat vision will stop it. No good. It's shielded somehow. In either case, we face the evil of genocide. And my task is to punish those responsible for evil. But who shall be held accountable? Whose sin is this? The humans? Or the superhumans? Tell me, Norman McKay. Judge. Me? Yours is the soul that guides me. Well, how can I? There, there is no evil here. There is tragedy and bedlam and... Judge. Carefully. I don't know what to do. You can see that, can't you, Billy? Every choice I've made so far has brought us here, has been wrong. So listen to me, Billy. Listen harder than you ever have before. Look around us. Look at what we've come to. There's a bomb falling. Either it kills us or we run rampant across the globe. I can still stop the bomb, Billy, that much I'm sure of. What I don't know is whether I should be allowed to. It's the superhumans or mankind. One will pay the ultimate price. And the decision is not for me to make. I'm not a god. I'm not a man, but you, Billy, you're, you're both. More than anyone who ever existed, you know what it's like to live in both worlds. Only you can weigh their worth equally. Fight the brainwashing, Billy. You can let me go, or with a word, you can stop me. Do you understand the choice that can be made by you alone? A tear escapes from Billy Batson's eye. It answers for him. Then decide. Decide the world. As Superman streaks away, I see the look of fear on Billy Batson's face. Not fear of death, but fear of life. Fear of his own life. And looking at him, I hear the words of Wesley Dodds once more. And when he cries... Shazam. Seven thunders utter their voices. I see the lightning strike. I see the young man transformed once again into Earth's mightiest mortal. Billy Batson had spoken his magic word. In a flash of red, he speeds off into the skies after Superman. Marvel, no! With strength drawn from somewhere beyond even the power of magic, Marvel hurls the Man of Steel back to Earth Ugh! and streaks upward. Superman, are you? I'll live. Where's Marvel? He's up there. He's reached the bomb, but he can't penetrate the force field. I've got to help him. But once again, Superman is too late. Marvel has made his decision. Shazam! 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 Shazam!